Hello everyone, so before I get into this video, I want to explain some things that I kind of want to explain. Um, so this is probably going to take up like half of the video if you want to skip ahead, go for it. But if you want to know what's kind of happening, stick around. Okay, so I kind of want to explain a few things. Okay, first, I'm trying to get a lot of tours and tutor tutorials up um, because I really want you guys to get inspiration. Um, I'm trying to get a bunch of different stables out there, like maybe some fancier ones. I also want to go a lot simpler, maybe with some barns. Um, Tutorial-wise, um, whatever I kind of think, maybe, or if you guys want to comment down below ideas. Um, Roleplay-wise, for my for my uh, videos, I'm I'm working on figuring out what I want to do for that. Um, also, sorry I've been gone for so long. Um, I'm making, I'm working on making a video to explain that, so that's for another video, um, but yeah, I'm sorry that was gone, I'm back, I'm trying, um, and yeah, I'm really just trying to get different stables out there, I really want to go simpler or more intense and just base it off different stables and all that, um, but yeah, I... <laughs> I just don't know. Um, I know I've been doing a lot of tours recently, but um, I kind of also was on. I also wanted to do this because I have some series that I want to explain that. Um, so there's going to be some series that I'll do more of, some series I do less of. So barn tour wise, um, barn tours I'll try and post maybe once a week or even if I ever have a barn. So um, all the barn tours are going to be in one playlist, but. Some barns will be based off, you know, what I build, and then some are going to be, you know, other people's builds, so just keep that in mind that not all of them are built by me, but I think there's really one that's not so far. Okay, and then Ranch and Craft. Um, for Ranch and Craft, I'm not sure. I'm Maybe I'll post that like once a month or something. It's just hard to find out what I want to do. Um, but maybe comment down below if you may, guys maybe want some more building or something in that. Um, I'll probably live stream on my TikTok or something. Um, or actually probably Twitch. Um, Twitch is Sheppycraft um, as well. Um, and yeah, I just have a lot of stuff. Um, so yeah, um, Springfield Estate Roleplay. Um, I'm going to be trying posting that a lot more. I'm so sorry about that. Um... But yeah, uh, I'm gonna be doing a Q&A eventually, so um, enough chattering, let's get into this tour. Okay, so going in, you have, um, so when you first walk in, you have this really nice um, smallish arena. Um, I know it's a small arena, but it's also for um, a dry lock turnout, so if the horses um, can't have like grass, um, because, like, they're fat or something, I don't know. You can always turn them out in here and just throw some hay in there and they'll be all set. And I really like it. Um, and this table, I really went a lot simpler, guys. Um, here we just have pastures. I'll get to those later. Um, but let's just start off with the main stable. And I'm going to be introducing all the horses because why not? Um, so this, so as you see, it, it really gives like that old feel, um, I'm gonna post, I'm gonna put some pictures up right now, and, um, these are kind of, it's, this is kind of what I was trying to go for, it's like, have you ever like seen like those like, so it's like a old racing barn mixed with like an old kind of heavy horse barn, um, where like the stalls are all seized as cross size, I don't really know if they are or not, but, um, I'm posting this picture so you guys get a better idea, but I feel like as a racing stable, everyone's always so busy, so putting, like, everything kind of in one area, I feel like works really well. Um, the stables are small, but there's some bigger, some smaller, um, because, you know, they revamped it, so some horses have bigger, just depending on, you know, what they like, and these are kind of the stables, they're very simple, um, design, and it's actually quite airy also in here, which is kind of nice, um, I'll introduce you to the horses. So we have Brumby, and then we have Chaco. I don't know if this was Chaco right, but he's a really cute little fjord. We have Cellar, and then we have Radar. 
and he's cute. Then we have Crime. Um, Crime is very, he's very skeptical. Um, Ranger, Molly J or MJ. Um, I want to get some like references from like movies and stuff, but also like kind of hinting them. So it was either like hinted or not. Um, some of them, I mean, like, all these are kind of basic names, but Molly J is, um, long for MJ. I know in Spider-Man, okay, guys, it's not, like, the same exact name, but, again, hinting. So, if you think MJ, you feel like you think Spider-Man, so. Anyway, so then we have Maggie, just, um, <laughs> Maggie from The Simpsons, or just whatever name you feel. Um, we also have Bago, um based off of a tiktoker i i don't even know their username um we have sherbert because sherbert ice cream <laughs> uh we have sarabi sarabi's based off of lion king i think it's simba's mom and then chief which i never even put chief's name up here so ignore that guys i'm sorry chief <laughs> um and then over here we just have i don't know why there's carpet oh yes yeah, because there's um sea lanterns because instead of using light blocks i was like let's use sea lanterns because that's really smart no it wasn't um but here we just have a little hay pile because you know i feel like people would be running around throwing hay i don't know uh we also have cross ties um very simple you just put them in tie them up and you're good to start tacking um so like if you didn't want to tack them up in their stall using this you could always just use this um depending on the horse i guess and there's let's see one two three four of those and i use glass for a normal change and i kind of put a slit throughout the whole thing so there's like some sort of airflow you know and then we also have these stables um some more stalls and then um shavings um and then more stalls and then some hay storage and this you can just kind of flip down and get your hay um, this is a little round pen. It's actually quite big, and it's kind of nice because it's right here. You can just start lunging them whenever you please, and it is very, very nice to have. And I actually really like it here. Like, I don't know. It's a vibe. And then here, um, each barn does have an indoor arena in it. And I kind of like it because it feels like a bad, like, it feels like bad weather outside, you know? Like, let's say it's really bad. Um, you know, you don't want to just keep all these horses just pooped up, so you could kind of just turn them out in these, into the indoors, um, so they can still run around a bit, and in here you could also turn them out into the round pen since it's so big. But I kind of like that. Now we'll go out here, um, we just have some nice little, I don't know, gardens, and then we have the pastures, and, uh, these are kind of some of the bigger pastures. Each pasture has hay and water, there's no horses out here at the moment. And yeah, and just some good hay and water. And there's one, two, three, four. Uh, the fourth one is the biggest one, of course, and it's really big. We'll get to that in a second. And I know I'm flying. Let me just deal with it. Um, here we have just the smaller pastures. Um, uh, this pasture usually fits one. This one can fit two. Um, so maybe if you were like bringing in a new horse, you could just turn them out in here or in there whatever floats your boat now we'll move on to this barn this barn has more horses and this arena is a bit bigger um and i really like it it's a really nice indoor again you can turn them out um over here we just have some cross ties where you can just hook them up here and groom them as you see these stalls are a bit bigger um they're three wide by the same length three by three they're pretty spacious i mean they're not the biggest but you know just depends on what your horse likes we have charger um monk um i don't even know i was just trying to figure out names thunder these are more basic names badger nico uh macy macy and nico are like twins but you know Lacy, and then these are all empty, and then you just have another little cross tie at the end. And again, you can turn them out if the weather's bad, and yeah, it's actually a pretty nice size. And I feel like the roof is high enough where you could also get some decent jumps in here. So yeah, and then here, 
um, right next to this. As you see, it's so this is meant to be like a little kind of jog around track. So again, used to be race disabled, so the horses could like warm up going around here, or if like the horses were getting used to this. You can also just ride your horses through here now. And here's just like a little picture grazing area. It's quite nice. Um, you get some cool pictures. So, yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna backtrack. We are backtracking all the way back because why not? Um, so this used to be the racetrack. And um, so inside the racetrack, there's a there's a huge like this is a decent size outdoor. And we just have some nice, simple jumps out here. And this is more like a training kind of jump. And so, you know, I figured, you know, you'd want to keep the racetrack. So this is just horse dirt. And pretty much if you wanted to like, uh, you know, if you were like practicing for cross country, but need to like work on, I don't know, stand or something, you could just like canter them around and it's also nice because I know in some like saddle seat or I don't know what competitions these are it's nice to like practice like just going around like that so I don't know I thought it was pretty cool I thought it was kind of a cool idea to incorporate anyways now we can go back over here so this is just a little pasture to um, turn out the horses um here's a these are uh three bigger pastures um for the horses because you know pooped up and all and then this is actually the final thing i know um that's kind of why i wanted to say something at the start of the video because i knew this tour would be super duper long so these horses um have these smaller stables um a little different um but they also have runs um because i thought that was nice um so these horses on this side have runs and then yeah um and then we also have cross ties and then this is supposed to be i don't know so maybe you could put a cow in here and then release them or put a horse in here i don't know it, it would also be a good mare and full stall maybe um big arena in here um there's also hay in here lots of hay and then we have dreamer sylvester danger road um mavis and then those are all the horses in here and th th there there are also a lot of stalls and then we also have shavings area more stalls and these are actually a lot bigger stables and this is just a little exit to this arena i mean pasture and i feel like and i was like i don't know do i want more stalls and i was like yes and these stalls are really nice um for horses that need more room or I don't know for anyone but yeah and then oh, oh, around here is just a little outdoor stable area um so like if a horse was maybe on stall rest but you still want them to, to have some outdoor time you can put them in here and yeah that's really the whole tour i do hope you guys enjoyed this short tour slash longer video um but yeah, that's really it. Um, thank you so much for watching, guys, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!